Welcoming participants, President of Faculty of Peace, Comrade Kelly Osumbo, said the organization is a non-political entity aimed at ensuring peace in the society. The overall objective of the strategy for sustainable peace is to contribute prevention of armed conflicts, effective conflict resolution, sustainable peace building, and sustainable state building, increase human security. Speaker after speaker, who include Malam Nuruddin Asonoje, Khan and PFN Youth Wing Chairman Reverend Phil Aroje, human rights activist Omobude Awo, Bini based musical icon Ambassador Sayomori Joseph, and Colonel Paul Ogbebo retired, dwelt extensively on the theme of the conference Roadmap to Sustainable Peace Using Culture of Excellence as a Guiding Principle. To suffer as a people, there is this discombobulation every direction we talk. Not because there is a destitution or a diet of resources, but in spite of the superfluity of resources. Because all of these resources coagulate in the hands of the insignificant few. Peace in the family, or your business, or in any remarkable organization, or at home, or in nation rather, will not be possible in mediocrity. Because the purpose of excellence is mediocrity. to operate us. So All of us will be prepared to this day. But that will be temporary peace. We are not sustainable peace in our society. The youth go back to the joy of sit down and find out what to do with yourselves. Peace and freedom are synonymous. Then for peace to be sustainable, it has to be freedom for or from something. And what is that thing? Some participants comment on the gains of the conference. Stop violence and bring peace to our society. Even take it further to sustainable peace. We need every hand on deck. As the election is coming right now, I say you don't need to be used as an electoral tool for the politicians. I've benefited. The event was attended by representatives of the military, police, NSCDC, EFCC, ESTMA, students, and other organizations. Ikmomosa Ugiagwe reporting.